Hello everyone. In today's tutorial, I'll show you how to record and transcribe voice memos or audio using the Apple Notes app on macOS Sequoia. Let's get started. To record a voice memo or audio and generate live transcription, launch the Notes app by clicking its icon in the dock or using Spotlight Search in the menu bar. Type Notes in the search box and click the Apps icon or press Enter on your keyboard. By the way, I am currently using the beta version of macOS Sequoia and looking forward to installing the final version. Next, click the Create a Note button in the toolbar to create a new note and select your new note from the notes list. You can change the title, for example, voice memos. The first line of the note becomes the title of your note. If you click the record audio button now, you will notice it's grayed out. To activate the button, click the note text, then click the record audio button again to open the recording panel on the right side of the app. Click the red record button to start recording. For example, you might say, Hi Robert, we have decided to hold a meeting on September 27th. Will you be able to attend our monthly meeting? To pause the recording, click the pause button. Once you have finished recording, click the stop button to view the transcription of your audio or voice memo. To listen to your recording, click the play button. To add an image or a PDF file to your audio message, Drag the image or PDF document into your note or search for it by clicking the media button in the toolbar, then selecting attach files or photo and selecting it here. To generate live transcriptions directly within the Notes app for your voice memos, click the Show Transcript button, click the Record button and start recording. For example, by the way, I have some good news for you. I will tell you all about it on Monday. If you like this video, Make sure to subscribe and ring the bell for more. Thank you. If you need to edit the transcription of your voice memo, select it, copy, and paste it into your note text. You can now edit, format, and highlight it. To change your text's font or font size, hold down the command key and press T on your keyboard to open the font window. You can now change the font and font size in this window as desired. You can also access your fonts by clicking the Format menu, selecting Font, and then choosing Show Fonts. To share your audio, text, and images, right-click or Control-click on your note, select Share Note, and then choose the app you want to use to send your message. For example, if you choose Messages, enter your recipient's email 
address or phone number to send your message. If you need a free speech to text transcription app that offers a secure environment for transcribing sensitive audio recordings, meetings, lectures, interviews, video, and audio files directly on your Mac, iPhone, or iPad without needing an internet connection, check out ICO at the end of this video. ICO supports audio in 100 different languages. I hope you learned something new today. If you did, please consider subscribing by clicking on the LT Lucid Tutorials logo and sharing the video link with your friends. Your support will inspire me to create more videos for you. Thank you for watching.